We're ready with Pedro Santos. First question will go to Jacob. Pedro, two, <laughs> I don't really know where to start. You guys had those two huge chances and really dominated play in the second half. Give up a goal that probably deflated you guys quite a bit, but but came back. Uh, I guess take us through kind of the emotions at the the last few minutes of this game and, and how you guys are feeling coming out of it. Uh, yeah, was was a little bit disappointed, but uh, in the other way, it was in the end was a good point because um, yeah, we had uh, two clear chances to to kill the game, and after that we consider uh, a goal, and uh, but that show our mentality that we always uh, we always believe we never quit, and we run behind the res the, uh, the result, and we we get the the late goal. And we take the, the point, and in the end of the game was a, was a good point. When Jossie comes into the match in the 60th minute, just in general, what did you see you guys doing better in the attack? Yeah, we know that uh, Jossie was, is the guy who, who can run uh, behind the, the, the back line. So uh, in that game, we, 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 didn't, did, we didn't too much on the first half. And when he came, we 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 stretch more uh, more the Red Bull, and we open more space to to create opportunity. And was was unlucky; he didn't score the the goal. Uh, couldn't change the game, but um, but he he bring his energy and fight, and he helped the team to 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 get the the point. Thanks for the time, Pedro. I appreciate it. Um, it, last week against Toronto, they really went against your side of the field. And then today you're playing a team in New York who has scored seven goals in three games coming into it. How are you feeling with your defense uh, moving into the season, your, your growth in the uh, left back position there and how every challenge that's come up, you've been able to, to stop them coming in your way and also the team as a whole. How are you feeling defensively? Yeah, I feel I feel very confident. So we work. Uh, we knew it that allow how they they want to to break us, and we work a uh, a lot uh, during the week to to close the space. And we did we did an amazing job. The the back line we did an amazing job to close that space. They didn't create anything uh, uh, running play. They just had the set pieces and was the the biggest challenge that we had. And overall, I think the. Uh, the team did a very good job, and especially on the second half. We controlled uh, all the second half. They didn't create anything. And like I said, we, we had the uh, two biggest opportunities to, to kill the game. And also um, ask Darlington this too. What do you see difference in mentality from the 2022 crew to the 2021 crew? I, I think... Uh, we we are we are always believing now. So last uh, last season, we had uh, a lot of games that we come to the we start the game uh, not very well and conceding goals and running behind the result. And if we concede like in ten games, we always running behind the results. The the the, the mentality is come low. Uh, and this 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 year we are trying to start the game well start to score the first goal uh, but in the last uh, the last three three games we we they concede we concede the first goal but we can see that the mentality is always try to to score one and try to score the second one to to change the result I appreciate it thank you you're welcome